move forwards with... Oh, that's, that's very intuitive. Don't have to... And hold back to reverse. There we go. Rotate the camera. And adjust the height with this as well. Very nice indeed. Old Nintendo Gamer. And son. Hello and welcome to the demo entitled Chapter 1 of Dredge. Don't know too much about this game apart from it popped up in a Nintendo Direct a long while ago, actually. At least uh, the middle of last year, and it's from Team 17, being the publishers, and Black Salt Games, a New Zealand uh, indie dev company. Let's have a look what this... I can't... Can I change the settings? I can just change... Um, uh, language, they have a clock style, yeah, we'll have 24 o'clock, metric, yes, we'll have metric kilograms and meters, reflections on, tutorials on, we need everything on, and accessibility, so color options, so if you're colorblind or having problem, motion smoothing, turning dead zone, camera, um, camera on the Y is automatically inverted, very nice, audio controls, we will find out how to control what we're doing in game and dredge makes it sound like we're dredging the depths in the bottom right there. Look at this. It's absolutely delightful. Angular wanted. You were doing your job, Lighthouse. Right, so we have a shipwreck. Um, are we going to have to rebuild ourselves to allow us to become a better fisherman by equipping better equipment? It sounds as if it's that sort of game. I'm intrigued as to how this demo is only chapter one, though. Must be a story going through it and certain points to allow us to enter chapter two if we bought the full game. Let's find out in chapter one. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You are lying on a cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handheld of workers in disembarking from a boat nearby, and the man notices you. Welcome to Greater Marrow. I must say, quite a dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Oh well, well, well. I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, when, uh, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you uh, get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while we get your bearings in the light. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but uh, get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. <laughs> and keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Right, so we've crashed. We've just woken up dizzy and going, where the hell am I? And um, he's told me to, blah, blah, blah. X, what's X? X is bring up my uh, management systems. Um, I have a regular engine, it installs in two hours. It's operational, it allows me 14 kilometers 40 knots, sorry, it's a KN, not an M. I got 40 knots, and I got a, a peculiar engine. Right, okay. And I've got a basic fishing pole. Ah, so we're going to have to do some uh, item management to move things around. Can I actually pick this up? No, it doesn't matter. Um, and then I go to undock. Move forwards with... Oh, that's, that's very intuitive. Don't have to... And hold back to reverse. There we go. Rotate the camera. And adjust the height with this as well. 
Very nice indeed. I'm liking that. There's some fish here. Then press A to start fishing. Um, right, how do we fish? Um, we select our fishing pole. Yes, 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 yes. And we start fishing with the Y button. Okay. Blue mackerel species data added to the encyclopedia. So we got a blue mackerel now, and I can put the blue mackerel. I could have rotated that, I think. Can I um, still? Oh, I can pick it up, and I can discard it with ZL. I can rotate it with this as well, so we can fit a few mackerel in. Right, okay, that's pretty good. And then I place it with A. So item management in um, one of these games. That's going to cause problems here. Can I pick this up? I can't pick my fishing pole up. So I do want to pick this up for now because it's going to cause problems later. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to have, I can't fit whatever happens. I can't fit a fish in the other one. It's upside down, but who cares? So I can start fishing again. Okay, let's start fishing. Now, uh, why the pole? There we go, another one. I can place that there. I can start fishing again. We can place that there, start fishing again. Hey, I caught a trophy, lovely. This is good, we got some, uh, a lot of blue mackerel here. What time is it? Oh, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. Nice time for fishing. Um, pick up, no, I don't want to pick up. I want to, oh, stock depleted. Right, so it is 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, And we just want to go and do some more fishing. Okay, so it's about fishing. Let's go, start fishing. Oh, he's a beauty. That's a good one. I can rotate this one and fill in that space I didn't think I could fill in earlier. Yay! Right, and start fishing. Let's get some more of these. And. Uh oh. Very much. We'll have that one rotated there. Marvelous cod. And where can we rotate this one? Thank you, Mr. Cod. We'll have him there. Stock depleted? Yes. Disturbed water. It's starting to rain. So we press B to go back to the boat. This is very relaxing. And I saw some fish over there. It is now two o'clock in the afternoon. I don't know if we've got time to do this, but we will make sure we're pointing back home. Disturbed water. It's very shallow. Um, you don't have the right equipment for this spot. Oh dear. So that's disturbed water. We've had it. I think that might be... I think the camera is... Disturbed waters. So basically... That is our day done because we don't want to be pushing too far. And it's all disturbed water by the looks of it. Maybe I can do a little spot a little further along. There's another village down there. Oh, I could do some fishing. Okay, coastal. Oh dear. Thank you very much. Start fishing. I'm trying to keep my eye on the clock. Eh? Thank you very much. Uh, stock's depleted. My goodness me. Now it's 6 o'clock. I need to get back home. Which is... Does it give me an indication? I think I don't like the camera to go this backwards for me. Um, Select your lights. Oh, you can you can turn lights on. Really? Ah, okay. How do I select them though? And then toggle with Y. Holding L, then toggle item with Y. Lights up the night. Stronger lights. Uh, less. Uh, stronger lights lessen the effects of panic. All right. You aim with this spyglass. Spyglass. Who oh, can I use it? How do I use my spyglass? Lights. 
foghorn. Ah, you use it by now pressing Y. Ah, okay. And then we can use a spyglass. Oh yeah, I can see the spy. I can spy. Now the up and down is weirdly the wrong way. Okay, I'm gonna have to go into the options very quickly because that bothers me. Uh, inverse the camera movement on the x-axis. If you're finding moving the camera feels strange, try this. Inverse the movement on the camera. If you're finding the camera feels strange, try this. Alright, let's try the... not the lights. Let's try the spyglass now. Yes, it moves properly like a... Uh, pulling back goes up and there's a, it, it does what a first person shooter now does that like it should do what is that ah you can spy stuff with the spy fish uh, like what type of fish is there okay thank you very much um so we're gonna go back home because the fog is settling in how do we park up dock a more boat dock hold down a lovely you step onto the dock at Greater Marrow. The mare is waiting nearby. Ah, 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 I see you returned in one piece. Very good, 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 good. Before you head off into town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. I owe you money, somehow. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I am more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel. Yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan. <laughs> but I want to make this easy for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're a man who eats too much and you've got a gold chain. Hmm. And you can't even tie your tie properly. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. Hmm. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. Hmm. So to recap, You'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt and in turn keeping the population fed and satisfied, understand? Doing your job for you, okay. Uh, selling fish helps the town and pays off my debt, got it. Where do I sell the fish? A local fishmonger will apprise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours. Off you go then, sell those fish while they're still fresh. Right then, so there's my storage here. Marvelous. My storage locker, which I don't want to put anything in the locker. I don't want to put fish in the locker. Let's go make some money then. So I need to select things like this, undock, and go to the fishmonger. So go to the fishmonger. There he is, a little fishmonger. Nice sharp knife you have there. You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies huzz, huzz, buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. Uh, <laughs> it takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns on the islands might pay you different. But while you still got a debt outstanding, you suggest you work off paying it off first. That's true. So, let's see what you got. Um, pick up, discard to storage, sell. Twelve dollars, yes please. I'm gonna sell all of them. Twelve dollars. Ooh, seventeen dollars for a cod. Better to get loads more mackerel, cause they can. Right then, I just debt adjusted one dollar, so damn it. So let's see what you got. Uh, hmm. Oh, I can just press uh, Y to or sell all fish and just um, do a thing. Storage, I got nothing in storage. Sorry. The mayor's standing outside the fishmonger's store. Oh, excellent work. Well, I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here. I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone would like to make you something of it. Why don't you take it? What is it? A research part, a curious looking component, could be used to develop new equipment. 
But uh, we need some investigation at a dock first. So I pick it up. And I place it in there. Oh, one last thing. Your local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. But that's going to cost some money though, isn't it? So if I go to the shipwright. What's this? Research, rest, unlock. Research. Ah, not available in the demo, right? So none of this is available in the demo, but you can um, upgrade parts, of course. Not available in the demo, not available in the demo. Thank you very much. Um, this is very relaxed. It's quite nice. I'm enjoying this. Uh, onto the shipwright. As you walk into the yard, you see a shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks at you briefly before turning back to her work. Ah, huh. huh, you must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favours around here. Payment is up front and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take any damage from the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up, mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. <sighs> Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Um, research part. A curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment. I would need some investigation at a dock first. So... I need investigation, not dock. So if I put that there. Uh huh, right. So if I went to my peculiar engine, I can't move it. Uh, okay. Ah, weighted line. Strengthened lines can catch larger and deeper fish. I could buy that for 150. Dollars. If where's my money? Where's my money? Where's my money? I can't see on the screen how much money I have. Mm, must be somewhere. And a uh, simple skimmer catches shallow fish, and I have enough money for that one because it is a uh, small spool makes for limited reeling speed. However, catching fish live uh, in the shallows. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, rusty outboard engine. It's operational. It's got 10, my mine is a 14 knots, so I've got a better one than that. And we've got um, different lights, okay. How do I research this though? Ah, here, so if I research hydraulic rod, not available, ah right, it's not available in the demo whatsoever. Um, Oh, engines. Here, 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 here. Not available in the demo. Pots. Pots and nets. I can't research either. So how would I... How would I research this then? Pick up. Put in my storage, because it looks like... A curious looking one. A research part. Could be used to develop new equipment, but you need to investigate a dock first, right? Okay, so the research at the dock is completely locked to me. So even though I wanted to improve with that part, I couldn't. So the only thing I can do at the moment then is rest. Resting until dawn. Ship loans. I only owe 32 more dollars. So if I go now and undock. Oh, I can't. I can't undock. Oh, you can hold down the A. Oh, I can't undock. What's up? What haven't I done? You want to install stuff, right? Way there, way there, way there. Um, fishing speed is plus 35. This is coastal. Uninstall and discard. Sell for 37. Um, if I wanted to uninstall my. This is weird, right?
Does he want me to buy something? The skies were lit up with a weird crimson glow the other night. Did you see it? Yes, that's where. Alright, I think this is me done, but um, it gives you... I had special order come through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you the normal prices. Ah, little missions and stuff to do. They asked me for one golf flounder and one grey eel. Just bring them in when you have them. You need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch these. The shipwright should be able to sort you out for that. Ah, right, okay, okay, thank you very much. Right, so we go to the shipwright. Get that shallow water, just enough money to buy the simple, which is a shallow water. So how do I buy this? A, I've um, installed it over here, right? Um, install. Right. I should have done this last night. Now it's uh, in the middle of the night. Um, back to my storage for two seconds because I want to uninstall this one. I want to rotate it and I want to put it next here. All right, basic fishing pole and we got a simple skimmer as well, which is for shallow water and a coastal one. So we can catch a greater variety of fish. And then my cabin, oh, pursuits. Uh, oh, right, okay, these are orders. Map. Not available demo, not available demo, not available in the demo. Marvelous. And an encyclopedia which shows... Um, oh, cool, cool, cool. Exotic fish, blah, blah, blah. Aberrations. Messages in a bottle you can find. There's 12 of them. Uh, that's the encyclopedia. Thank you very much. The cabin. Oh, pursuits. Um, and then you click on it to make it disappear. I'm a guy who catch a glove founder and a grey eel. I need a rod that can handle shallow water. So I suppose we're going to do that if we've got time. Oh my goodness me. Let's get out of here. Oh no, 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 no. Why can't I undock? Oh, I can. Okay. Marvellous. This boat. Handles like a dream. So I need the shallow waters one, yes? What's this? Can I see where it is? This is disturbed water. Uh, shock low. Oh, what's that? A fishing boy, a uh, floating boy. Systematic passage, dangerous hazards. Okay. Its dim light provides a brief respite in the gloom of the night. Very nice. That's not shallow waters, is it? Oh, it is shallow water. Let's start fishing. I couldn't uh, fish here before. Yes, we got a gulf flounder. And we need one gulf flounder, don't we? So we'll get two, just in case. Marvellous. Gulf flounders everywhere. Um, start fishing. We'll deplete this stock because... No, I needed to go here. And we will we'll not deplete the stock. I need... Uh-oh, it's getting late. I need an eel. Where am I going to get an eel? A bit over there. Come on. You have some eels here? Oh, no, 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 no. Eels! Oh dear. Hey, we got an eel. Right, okay, so this is... Um... Oh dear, that's terrible. You have to press the, the, the catch button early. It's quite infuriating. Right, that's enough eels. Let's get back before we die. Um, I would have to press the L button to turn my lights on. Uh, exposure to fog and other things increases your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Okay. Oh, you hold down A to dock. There we go. So if I go to the fishmonger now... Have you got any fish for that order? Yep. Just leave whatever you have and I'll keep the order on until it's ready. Um, so we got a, a flounder, and we can 
move that across here. It's got a match. Hey, matching. We'll get that eel over here as well. Thank you very much, please. The fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Lovely. 52. Good, good. They should be pleased with these. Oh, I got another order here. There's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And, well, you know, the rights are like round here. The nights are like round here. Good luck. So, I can sell other fish, though. I can sell all fish for 51. Marvellous. Just sell all fish for 43, because my debt has been adjusted. Um, $7 of debt. What is that eyeball at the top there? Tuesday, is that how scared I am and how tired I am? My storage has nothing, because I can't do anything. And does the ship rate have anything before I need to go to bed? No. Uh, I need to, yeah. Nah, she ain't got nothing. Crack bulbs and cloudy lenses. There we go. I can go to bed. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible visible apprehension. 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 Why are you here? Ugh. Oh, there's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back along the path and leads to the light. I'm not here to see people, actually. What's that X? Oh, X is my ship, isn't it? Where's my cabin? Pursuits! Yes, we've got to catch two arrow squid and one black grouper. Right, and my encyclopedia has uh, increased in size. Thank you very much. Um, let's get out of here while it's uh, early morning. The mayor wants a word, does he? Oh, just a person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Uh, okay. Where are we going to Little Marrow then? I'm east. Remember that. The mayor, the mayor hands you a small damp package found uh, bound in string is dripping slightly. The dock, the dock worker will put you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. <laughs> don't forget to check your compass map if you get lost. <laughs> right, let's undock then, which is B. Oh, that's, I mean, the feeling of... That's got to be Little Marrow, right? I'm um, east. We're heading east. That's Little Marrow. We'll head over there. i sure I saw some squid on my... Disturbed water. Oops, it's Y. Eh, yeah, some mackerel. Oh, a grotesque mackerel. Very grotesque indeed. Right, um, let's get over here. Fishing on the way. Fishing on the way back. Ah, cod, eh? I don't want to catch too many cod. Where were those? Ah, flounder. Don't flounder in the water. Right, I don't want to flounder. Let's go and dock over here. Hmm, what a delivery? Uh, let's say uh, He tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. He can, can't say for sure, but it feels like he's shielding it from your view. Oh, drug running now, are we? Mm. Oh, yeah, nice and fresh. This should do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. $25. Mm. I was given this old book a few weeks ago, but it didn't make much sense to me. Uh, you'll surely get more use out of it. Uh, he pulls out a crumpled book from his bag pocket and hands it to you. A number of the pages are folded over. 
Ah, uh, keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're out in the water. Stop by for a chat any time. I know how lonely it can be. Right. So if I go to my thing, what's what book has he just given me? Encyclopedia. Pursuits. Grotesque fish. Show the fish. Ah, I can show the fishmonger. A grotesque fish. Okay. Here, look at this. Look at it. Um, oh, he's given me um, extra bits and pieces for the encyclopedia. Maybe. Cargo. Right, let's get out of here. Let's um, undock with B. Oh, there's a trader there as well. Maybe I need a dock again, sorry. There's a trader, I can see. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you from over silver spectacles. Oh, hello, is that? Uh, no, I uh, don't believe we met. Uh, forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. Uh, I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Uh, have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Sorry. Right, um, trinkets and things for the trader. There were some fish over here. Jinky neck. Jinky's a stingray. Uh, shapes in the deep. Stock low. We don't have enough equipment for this spot, right? Okay. Where were those? Ah, oh, the squid come out at night, man. I'm not gonna have room for this. I'm not gonna have a room for this at all. Um, if I move this there, then I move this here, then I can move this here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good. I can move the. Oh, too late. Uh, let's get back home. Wait until the night and get some. Squid. Oh, it's nearly night time already. Where are you, squid? This is delightful. Obviously, I can't go over to those places. Not knowing how big the game is. So, just to finish off. No, I better not. No, I better not. No, no, no. no. And how much space squid takes up. Oh, oh! Something happened there. Squid! Start squid fishing. I got an arrow squid. Lovely. Pointy. Now, what I want to do is move this one. How do I move? Pick up with A. I want to rotate this beast because he could fit there. Blinking perfectly. And I can fit another squid in right there, as it were. If I pick this one up, though, and put him down here. This flounder can come up here. I can fit a bunch of squid if I wanted to. Damn. Marvelous. We can get a bunch of squid in here. Two more. Let's go. Start fishing. Yes, please. There we go. And I have no room for another squid unless I... Move the squid up here, put the cod down here, and put the squid up there. There we go. Now we're done. And now we're going to crash. I need to put my, li my lights on. My lights are on. Uh-oh. I'm getting spooked. Why am I so spooked? You're a fisherman. Oh. It's only fish. There's no krakens out here. Maybe there are krakens, and um, I don't know anything about it. Right then, let's uh, finish off. This is our last jaunt at sea. Ooh. 
I've docked up some rolls, that is. Uh, off to see the fishmonger, first of all. Um, but... I wonder if I've actually finished... Have you got that fish for the order? Yes. Just leave it wherever you have it. I'll keep it on order. Um, I don't think I have. So if I put the arrow squid here... I don't have this black grouper though, do I? No, I don't. Right, okay. Um, so I'm done. Alright, come back when you have everything. Now the regular business, eh? What is it today? You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. <gasps> oh, now this is a sort of specimen to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish, as though feeling for something. He pushes from one side of its stomach, and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open. From its stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing, and I'll pay you for the fish too, of course. Marvellous. It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts. I'm sure you'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Good job. Right, I want to sell all the other fish. Marvellous. And now I have this, which I should be able to put in my storage. Good. Thank you, fisherman. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Return to town. Fisherman's done. A man is looking at you through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I, I know I know what you took to the fishmonger. I, I know. I'll, I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Hmm. Meet me at Blackstone Oil. Uh, head out of this bay and cut south. I, I have business proposition that you want to hear. I'll be waiting. Right now, ship right. It's late. And intriguing, absolutely intriguing. I'm gonna rest up. I'm gonna call it quits on the first. Oh, I know we haven't finished the chapter, but it's been a little delight, actually. There's nothing I can do with the research parts. Um, oh, well, what am I. Why, why, why finish now when I can undock and go to... Where's my map? How do I get my map up? Right, uh, he did tell me where to go, actually. Cabin. Pursuits. What's my pursuits? Meet at Blackstone Isle. A man approached me, interested. He pulled out a fish, wants me to meet him in Blackstone Isle. Okay. And uh, there's the map. Where is Blackstone Isle? Little Marrow. Oh, it's X on there, so it's southeast. I need to head southeast. Okay, and the encyclopedia is telling me blah blah blah. Southeast, here we go. Blackstone Isle, are you here? Look at that beauty over there. Disturbed water. Oh, that's Blackstone Isle, surely. Where is me map? Yep, I'm looking at Blackstone Isle. Let's some... Um, let's see if we can get some fish. Profitable before we. Let's make this fishing trip profitable. There we go. Deplete the stocks completely. And let's get over. 
Yeah, we'll get that fishing spot on the way back out. Blackstone oil, this is. Dock. Marvelously straightforward, buried, ruined mansion, and a workshop. The workshop looks as though it hasn't been used in decades. I'm gonna go inside, it's locked. Meh. <laughs> Ah. Ruined mansion. The man is standing in a doorway, watching her approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. It's a necronomicon. Oh, you, you came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, arts and artifacts, treasures and truths and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. Oh, these patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. Oh, I carried items of great importance. As you can imagine, retrieving them is proving to be challenging. It's where you come in. Uh, my proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. Find me these lost relics and I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. You need not give up your fishing career. I merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? I accept that. Let's get on. An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. Uh, uh, uh. Lovely. The relics you're looking for a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other occ strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Thank you, my thank you, my good man. Let's undock and get the hell out of here. There was um, some fish over here. Fish. Oh, damn mackerels. Slapped in the face by a fish. Oh my god, there's loads of them. We gotta get back though, aren't we? It's getting late in the day. Um, which way is back though? There it is. Head for the lighthouse. Can I turn my light on? There you go. I won't be so spooked. Ooh, the fog is setting in. Oh, this is not... Where I should be, is it? Um, oops. Where is me map? Oh, it is where I am supposed to be. But it's um, around the back side. Yeah, see? See? You don't know where you are. Doc. Right then, let's get my loan repayment. I've got uh, three dollars to pay off here. I've got the lighthouse keeper and the builder to see as well. But before that, oh, I hope the seagulls don't wait there, wait there. Don't. Oh, come on! I was talking to the fishmonger. Keep an eye out for larger fish. Have I paid my debt off? Ah, uh, you can feed more mouse. You can pay for them all. Hey. The mayor's walking quickly towards you. He seems in a good mood, whilst with a spring in his step. Fantastic news! Thanks partly to your efforts, the Great Maru is growing. Our town it should be swarming with visitors any day now. <laughs> in fact, I've granted a consent uh, for your shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. Mm, I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger's services. He might have something to talk to you about soon. <laughs> Keep up the good work. I'm glad you've chosen to be here with us. I've, did I have a choice? The dry dock, eh? Oh, not the fishmonger, sorry. I found this book out back. It could be useful to you. The fishmonger reaches under the counter and hands you a damp battered book. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Thank you for the damp battered book. Um, so if I go here, these damp battered books. 
Search for the relics. Um. Read to unlock. Ah, there's a bookshelf, is there? Select an act selected an active book. Pass time to read. Okay, I haven't read this yet, and there's uh, things you can read to pass the time of day. Marvelous. Dry dock. Let's have a look here. Heart. Oh, this is a dry dock. You can make significant improvements to your vessel here. Uh, we're taking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. We need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal storage, that sort of things. Oh, there's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get at them. Uh, materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored, so don't worry if you have uh, half of what you need. Uh, Alright, so we need to... There you go. Upgrade rod spaces, upgrade your net spaces, upgrade your engine spaces, upgrade your light spaces, a new hull, blah blah blah, all things that can be upgraded here. Um... Not available in the demo, though, I'm afraid. You can't upgrade your ship in the demo. We don't want any of that nonsense. Uh, let's go and talk to the lighthouse keeper in the bottom here. What is it? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. Mm. There's a spot near the back of the Great Amaro where the current carries in the wreckage from the sea. From the sea? Some nights you can see an... A natural glow rising from that patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the depths. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Right, okay. And I could question further the builder. You approach a woman sitting at the dockside, staring out the sea. She turns to you. What is it like out there? It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward, moving along. Not so bad here. She's gazing out to sea again, lost in thought. Yeah. Sai, if you want me to get some materials, maybe we can move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just over north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need, and I can make a new place for myself there. And uh, you'd be welcome to visit too. Yeah. Just stack it up a steel point when you have anything. I'll uh, pay you when the job's done. So I would definitely, for my ship, need some extra attachments, which is probably where this research comes in to allow me access for the shipwright and the dry dock to build something I need to capture all the other bits and pieces that I need to build things. The lumber, the steel, the everything else. Why is my cabin flashing? The map! Not available in the demo. Right, I got two places I could visit if I wanted to. And me pursuits uh, get two lumber and two scrap. Maybe it does allow me to get them in the demo. But I'm not going to go any further. There's been a beautiful little game. Um, I hope you're looking forward to it. It's coming out very shortly on the Nintendo Switch. This is the demo, chapter one. Bye bye. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and give us a like if you've enjoyed our content. We're also on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, our private Discord server, and you can support us via coffee. All the relevant links are in the description below and in the banner above.